All right, folks. Uh, one of our uh, buddies, Big Craig One, uh, posted on our video this morning in response to the these Arctic ring seals. I wonder if we could have anything to do with the radiation from Fukushima. So we started looking into it a little more, and apparently they have no idea what is doing this to the animals. But their hair falls out. They develop ulcers on their flippers and skin, and they have lesions in their lungs, livers, hearts, and brains. Uh, they also say that uh, they've ruled out um, certain viruses that uh, they thought might have been able to do this, and they're continuing to screen for other viruses, bacteria, fungi, and algae, and stuff like that, but they've, they've already screened just about everything they know how to screen, and uh, they they still can't figure it out. So let's focus on hair falling out, the ulcers on the skin. Well, this is what radiation poisoning or radiation burns looks on a human skin. And you take a look at some of the things that are just visible on the outside. And we all know that hair loss is associated with radiation uh, poisoning as well. Uh, you look up lung carcinoma, most of the f uh, stuff you'll find is on smoking, but they talk about how radiation causes lesions uh, as well. Uh, all kinds of radiation can do stuff to your skin. Um, these are all radiation effects on the human skin right here. And you know, we know that it's not just this giant amount of radiation that China has found uh, out in the sea. And we actually have to apologize, when we initially reported this, we said, uh, there were, you know, dozens of gallons. We didn't realize it was 100,000 square miles uh, of radiation. God knows what else is in the air and what else is coming. Um, the situation gets worse every day. Radiation is leaking out every day. Not to mention that we have uh, nuclear alerts all over the world uh, every week. Just keep an eye on this, folks. Be safe.